so for the record this is my friend Vicky and Hi. she's a health coach which is kind of like mm -hmm. a life coach and mm -hmm. you've had some fun three of tea sessions so you know what to expect correct um, but just for the viewers I, I'm assuming that I'm assuming that viewers are going to be familiar with fast EFT, um, mm -hmm. which is a f kind of has evolved from EFT, which more people are familiar with. And so the idea of this video is to give people like life coaches um, mm -hmm. an introduction to fast EFT and how to use it on clients. And so I'll go over the tapping points just as a reminder. And I have recommended to you already that you go to fast3ft.com and sign up for the free quick start course, um, which I think you're going to do. One day when yes. I have time. One yes. day when you have time. Um, mm -hmm. So my idea is that even for people who are not practitioners, I would thoroughly recommend doing the, the quick start for course mm -hmm. first because mm -hmm. it gives you a really rounded overview. Um, but my idea is that life coaches might have clients who are upset or feeling strong negative emotions in the course of a session and mm -hmm. it might just be a nice thing to be able to do some tapping on them yes. to bring the feelings down mm -hmm. and help them to cope with it and you can teach them how to tap and um, and it's a, it's a nice kind of stress reducing yeah. technique. Absolutely. And then if they are really, really um, struggling with something, um, mm -hmm. you could refer them to me. Mm. And my website is newlife.com, which has an odd spelling, but it'll be on the screen somewhere. Um, maybe up there, I think. <laughs> anyway, so um, how do we start this? So you have a client. Well, I'm the life coach, and you're the client, mm -hmm. and um, you're feeling some strong negative emotions, and it's mm -hmm. kind of, it's you're focused on them and not the session, and they need to be dealt with, and you as a life coach have a technique that you can help them to, that, that you can help them with anyway. So, um, what you get them to do Mm -hmm. um, as a practitioner you have to kind of be aware of the situation and adjust your technique accordingly but this is one that would probably work in a situation where someone was mildly upset maybe not mm -hmm. if they're extremely upset but, but if, they, if they're mildly, mildly, mildly upset about something mm -hmm. yeah. what I would do first um, is ask them so make sure that they're sitting comfortably and so that's what I want you to do and then so I mean is there something that you can think of right now that bothers you yes you, okay well that's good you're not going to say anything about it but um, if you close your eyes mm -hmm. and take a deep breath okay think about this whatever it is, stressful situation that bothers you, can you feel it? Yes. Okay. Now, um, so just checking that you have something. Now open your eyes for a second. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, what I'm going to ask you to do now is to close your eyes again, take a deep breath, and I want you to find a happy, peaceful, kind of restful situation or place. It can be real or imagined and see if you can go there in your mind and feel what it feels like to be there. Can you do that? Yeah. Okay. And um, and so, are you there? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, if a client, sorry, I'm just gonna do some talking here. If a mm -hmm. client is really, really upset, they might not be able to do that immediately but yeah. I'm sort of banking on it being a mm -hmm. mildly stressful situation but mm -hmm. anyway so close your eyes again take mm -hmm. a deep breath go back to your happy place okay and I'm gonna grab your wrist and um, now take another deep breath and blow it out and say the word peace 
peace. Okay. So now, what that is, is an anchor. It's a hypnotic anchor. Mm -hmm. And so there's going to be an association in your mind now with a peaceful, happy place. And the breathing in, the breathing out, the holding of your wrist, top and bottom of, of the wrist, mm -hmm. and, um, and the word peace. Mm -hmm. And occasionally people don't like the word peace, in which case they can choose another word. Mm -hmm. um, another good thing to mention to clients is to is for them to tell you how they're feeling. They will probably have told you what it is that's bothering them because it'll be in the course of of talking to them in mm -hmm. the session. Mm -hmm. um, so anyway, so that's that. Now I want you to close your eyes, mm -hmm. take a deep breath, blow it out. But now I want you to go to your stressful situation that bothers you. Okay, can you feel it? Mm -hmm. All right. On a scale of zero to 10, where zero, it doesn't matter at all to 10, it's really bugging you and it's horrible and the worst it could be, how, what's your kind of stress feeling? Mm, probably eight, nine. Eight or nine, okay. Mm -hmm. It's quite high. Mm -hmm. But what I want you to do is to make it higher. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> ten's the limit. Well, ten's the limit. But sometimes people manage to get it up to like a fifteen or. Oh, really? Or oh, yeah, Sometimes they like oh, okay. even more. So see if you can make it more. Um, yeah. Okay. okay. What number is it at now? Yeah, I've definitely got to the ten. You've got to the ten. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now repeat after me. I'm going to tap. Um, the tapping points I should have mentioned before are between the eyes, two fingers between mm -hmm. the eyes, side of the eye, under the eye. Collarbone is around here, and you drop about I don't know half an inch or something below, and you use two fingers either side, just below the collarbone. Mm -hmm. The necklace is in the way. And then the wrists, the wrist is three acupressure points here, three here, so you grab top and bottom of the wrist, right. and those are the tapping Should and I squeezing points. The back? I don't know, yes, maybe. Right. It's not too bad, it's fine. It'll do. <laughs> so, close your eyes again. Mm -hmm. Now, it was a 10. Mm -hmm. Can you think mm -hmm. about it, make it a mm -hmm. 10 again. Mm -hmm. You got it? Yeah. Okay, repeat after me. Mm -hmm. I release and let go. Oh, sorry, I have to say something here again. This is called the quick tap. This is where we knock out a whole bunch of different negative emotions okay. um, that can often be associated with stressful and pleasant feelings. Okay, mm -hmm. so close your eyes. Mm -hmm. It was a 10. Can mm -hmm. you feel it? Yes. Is it a 10? It is a 10. Okay, say so after me. I release and let go. I release and let go. All sadnesses. All sadnesses. All fears. All fears. All emotional traumas. All emotional traumas. All angers. All angers. All resentments. All resentments. Guilt. All guilt. Judgments. Judgments. Abandonments. Abandonments. Betrayals. Betrayals. Rejections. Rejections. Hopelessness. Hopelessness. Helplessness. Helplessness. Feelings of having no control. Feelings of having no control. Feelings of being trapped. Feelings of being trapped. And everything else. And everything else. It's safe to let it all go. It's safe to let it all go. Just let it go. Just let it go. I'll grab your wrist, take a deep breath. Blow it out. And say peace. Peace. Okay. Now it was a 10. How does it feel now? Hmm. What's happened? What's changed? Well, I'm feeling lighter. Lighter? Okay, um, can you put a number on it? Yeah, well, seven, maybe. Okay, so it's come down, that's yes. good. Yes, definitely. Um, mm. Now, is there a particular aspect of... Or, and now, again, I, 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 want this to be no, I want this to be no content, so mm -hmm. I want you to just... just because I want this to, to be able to apply to anyone. Is there a particular aspect of this situation that you that that's pertinent? That's kind of um, at the forefront. Disappointment. 
Okay, so a feeling of disappointment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Do you feel it somewhere in your body or in your, like... Mm. Possibly sort of in my gut, in, yeah. Okay, so you know yeah. how it feels yes. and where it is. And mm. Okay, mm. so close your eyes, deep mm -hmm. breath. And I'm going to tap and you repeat after me. I release and let go. I release and let go. This feeling. This feeling. This feeling in my gut. This feeling in my gut. This feeling of disappointment. This feeling of disappointment. It's safe to let it go. It's safe to let it go. It's safe to let things be. It's safe to let things be. Things work themselves out. Things work themselves out. So I'm letting go of this feeling. So I'm letting go of this feeling. Just let it go. Let it go. I'm okay. I'm okay. Just grab a deep breath. Peace. Okay, so that feeling of disappointment, how does it feel now? Has it shifted? Has it changed? Mm -hmm. It is getting lighter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, five. It's a five, okay. <laughs> I'm still there, but yeah, I can. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So, um, now, uh, would you still describe it the same way? I mean, and, and do you still feel it? As a disappointment. Um, perhaps there's a bit of um, frustration as okay. well. Do you kind of feel it in the same place or like, I mean you don't have to feel it in your body no. but you might. No, I don't. But it's more in my head than frustration, I think. Okay, so you know where it is and you know how it feels. Mm -hmm. Close your eyes. Mm -hmm. We're going to tap this frustration. This frustration. It's safe to let it go. It's safe to let it go. It's safe to find other means. It's safe to find other means. Other ways to do things. Other ways to do things. It's safe to let this go. It's safe to let this go. It's not serving me. It's not serving me. So I'm going to let it go. So I'm going to let it go. Now. Now. Let's grab a deep breath. Say peace. Peace. Okay, I think it was a five and it was a feeling of frustration. What is it now? What's changed? What's shifted? Hmm. Yeah, so again, it's that feeling of lifting, light, lightness. That's good, isn't it? Very good. Okay. Yeah. How did, I mean, how would you describe your feeling? Well, what Don't number is it that now? Oh my um, let's think about the situation. Yes, find mm. it. See if you can mm. find it. Mm. Mm, maybe two, three. Okay. Can you describe it? I mean, you don't have to, but how does it feel? Um, uh, it's into an I don't know what to do. Um, and I need to do something. I think it's just a little sort of, I can't do nothing. So I've got to do something. So there's a sort of, push somewhere that says you can't just put blinkers on and completely ignore it. Okay. Close your eyes. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. But I feel like I have to do something. But I feel like I have to do something. I can't put blinkers on. I can't put blinkers on. <laughs> I is a push. <laughs> it's a a push. For me to do something. For me to do but something. But I don't know what. But I don't know what. <laughs> Just let it go. Just let it go. Things will become apparent. <laughs> Things will become apparent. I can only do what I can do. I can only do what I can do. Based on the information that I have. <laughs> Based on the information I have. And so the best thing for me to do. The best thing for me to do. Is to let this go. Is to let it go. So I can be clear eyed. So I can be clear eyed. Yeah. And see solutions. And see solutions. That might be right in front of me. It might be right in front of me. Much better to let it go. Much better to let it go. So I'm letting it go now. 
So I'm letting it go now. Deep breath. Peace. Okay, that feeling of I don't know what to do. How does it feel now? It's good. I feel like I can laugh at myself. Oh, that's good. That's the start, isn't it? <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, yes, that's good. Close your eyes, deep breath. Um, now, any negative feelings at all about this situation? See if you can find any. Because mm. it's important to get them all. Mm. No, probably not. Well, that's good, isn't it? Yeah, it's very good. Okay, very now, good. close your eyes, take a deep breath again. Okay, what I'd like you to do is think about this situation with your eyes closed, mm -hmm. preferably. Mm -hmm. um, and imagine solutions. You know, if things have changed, um, mm -hmm. it's been unexpected, but can you imagine things happening that might even make things better than they were before? Um, difficult. <coughs> okay. I just want you to try to imagine things falling into place, going into line. Oh, okay. Um, mm -hmm serendipitous things happening, people, mm -hmm. things, circumstances, okay. but, yep. but good ones, mm -hmm. okay, because mm. I think that if mm. you have that kind of mindset, then you're more likely to see solutions, um, you know, that present themselves and not overlook them. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So can you, can you do that? Can you... Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to tap. Mm. It's safe to yeah. see things clearly. It's safe to see things clearly. It's safe to see solutions. Safe to see solutions. It's safe for solutions to arise. It's safe for solutions to arise. To present themselves. To present themselves. Everything works out for me. Everything works out for and me. And I'm okay. And I'm okay. To go forward. To go forward. To see the things I need to do see the things I need to do. And do them. And do them. At the right time. At the right time. And the right people. And the right people. And the right circumstances. And the right circumstances. Will come along. Will come along. Just as I need them. Just as I need them. And so it's safe to be positive about this situation. And so it's safe to be positive about this situation. Because I'll be happier. Because I'll be happier. And I'll see things more clearly. And I'll see things more clearly. It's safe to let everything else go. It's safe to let everything else go. Go. Deep breath. Peace. Peace. Mm. Okay. How are you feeling? Mm. Definitely in a better place than before. Okay. Very mm, good. Thank you. Would you be happy to give this a go with clients? Do you yes. Think? Yes. Quite. It's positive. really quite. It's, it's not. It's not difficult. difficult at all. No, um, and you'll have the video to refer to, and yeah. I can give you some notes on the quick tab and yeah, things like that. I need to watch and the you should watch the quick start quick course. Start. Mm. And for any viewers, I have a website with a Fast EFT Utaptics Hypnosis page, and there are lots of videos there. Mm -hmm. And this video might be there as well soon. <laughs> um, so I hope everything's recorded correctly, <laughs> yes. otherwise we'll have to do this again tomorrow. Uh, uh, but anyway, thank you very much, Vicky. Very good. Um, thank you. Okay. Thank you. I'm glad you feel better. Yes, that was an opportune time. Yes, it was, wasn't it? Very. <laughs> anyway, very good. Thank you. Thank Brilliant. you very much. Brilliant. Okay. Yes, it wouldn't have happened if it was this morning. <laughs>